China's J-36 stealth fighter promises to dominate Pacific skies by 2035. American defense officials respond by accelerating the classified F-47 program. The engineering reality reveals why this matchup will determine air power dominance for the next 50 years. Welcome to Flight Deck, where we decode the engineering reality behind military aviation. Today we're analyzing China's most ambitious fighter program versus America's classified response, and why the outcome depends on engineering principles that go far beyond raw specifications. The J-36 represents China's attempt to leapfrog American air superiority through massive technological advancement. Chinese aerospace engineers studied every aspect of F-22 and F-35 operations, identifying what they perceive as fundamental limitations in American stealth fighter design. Their solution involves a radical departure from traditional fighter architecture. The J-36 features a flying wing configuration similar to the B-2 bomber, maximizing stealth characteristics while providing internal volume for advanced systems and extended range. This design philosophy prioritizes survivability and operational reach over traditional maneuverability. Chinese engineers claim this approach solves the fundamental limitation of current stealth fighters, the compromise between stealth shaping and aerodynamic performance. Defense intelligence assessments suggest the J-36 will feature advanced electronic warfare systems, hypersonic missile capabilities, and AI integration that automates many pilot functions. However, the engineering challenges in this ambitious design reveal why American aerospace engineers chose a completely different path. America's F-47 program represents evolutionary advancement rather than revolutionary redesign. Instead of reimagining fighter architecture, American engineers focused on perfecting existing stealth principles while adding capabilities impossible with current technology. The F-47 maintains conventional fighter proportions but incorporates materials science advances that didn't exist when the F-22 and F-35 were designed. Advanced metamaterials create superior stealth characteristics while eliminating maintenance requirements that plague existing stealth coatings. Most significantly, the F-47 prioritizes system integration over individual component performance. Rather than developing dramatically new configurations, American engineers created networking capabilities that transform individual fighters into nodes in a larger combat system. The aircraft's effectiveness depends less on standalone capabilities than on coordinating with other platforms. This reflects lessons from 20 years of stealth fighter operations. American pilots consistently report that situational awareness and information sharing provide greater tactical advantages than raw aircraft performance in most combat scenarios. Propulsion technology differences reveal competing philosophies about future air combat. The J-36's flying wing configuration accommodates larger, more powerful engines designed for extended supersonic crews. Chinese engineers prioritize speed and range, believing these provide decisive advantages in Pacific operations. The aircraft reportedly features adaptive cycle engines that optimize performance across different flight regimes. However, adaptive cycle technology presents enormous engineering challenges that China has never successfully implemented in operational aircraft. These complex mechanical systems historically prove difficult to maintain and unreliable under combat conditions. The F-47 uses an entirely different approach. Instead of maximizing individual engine performance, American engineers developed thrust vectoring systems providing unprecedented maneuverability. More importantly, the F-47's engines integrate seamlessly with electronic warfare systems coordinating with stealth systems to minimize infrared and electromagnetic signatures during all flight operations. Stealth technology evolution reveals the most significant capability differences. The J-36's flying wing configuration provides inherent stealth advantages through basic geometric principles. Chinese engineers claim this shaping eliminates the need for complex radar-absorbing materials requiring extensive maintenance. However, flying wing aircraft present fundamental challenges. 
large wing surfaces create substantial infrared signatures that are difficult to mask. The J36's engines must be deeply buried within the wing structure, creating cooling and maintenance access problems that could limit operational availability. The F-47 addresses stealth through active signature management rather than passive shaping alone. Advanced electronic systems can adjust the aircraft's radar signature in real time, making it appear as different objects or masking its presence entirely depending on tactical requirements. This active stealth enables entirely new tactics. The F-47 can appear as a civilian aircraft a flock of birds, or atmospheric disturbance depending on mission needs. More importantly, it can coordinate with other aircraft to create false radar signatures that confuse enemy air defense systems. Electronic warfare capabilities highlight the fundamental difference between Chinese quantity-focused and American quality-focused approaches. The J-36 incorporates powerful jamming systems designed to overwhelm enemy systems through brute force electronic attack using high-powered transmitters across broad frequency ranges. The F-47's electronic warfare systems focus on precision rather than power. Advanced signal processing identifies specific enemy radar characteristics and generates precisely targeted countermeasures that neutralize threats while minimizing electromagnetic emissions. More significantly, the F-47 coordinates its electronic warfare capabilities with other friendly aircraft and ground-based systems. This networking multiplies effectiveness while distributing power requirements across multiple platforms. Multiple F-47s can create overlapping electromagnetic fields, providing complete protection for friendly forces while simultaneously attacking enemy systems from multiple directions. Manufacturing philosophies reveal long-term sustainability differences that may prove decisive in extended conflicts. The J-36 program prioritizes rapid production using established Chinese aerospace manufacturing capabilities enabling higher quantities but potentially sacrificing reliability. Chinese aerospace manufacturing excels at producing large quantities of relatively simple systems but struggles with precision requirements for advanced stealth aircraft. The complex tolerances required for effective stealth shaping present manufacturing challenges Chinese industry hasn't previously mastered at scale. The F-47 emphasizes manufacturing quality over production speed. American aerospace companies developed entirely new production techniques specifically for sixth-generation requirements, ensuring consistent quality while enabling modular construction that simplifies future upgrades. This upgradability advantage ensures the F-47 remains competitive throughout its expected service life extending into the 2070s, while the J-36's fixed design may become obsolete as technologies continue advancing. Operational doctrine differences reveal how each nation expects to employ these aircraft. Chinese military planning assumes the J-36 will operate primarily in defensive roles, protecting Chinese territory and asserting control over disputed South China Sea areas. The aircraft's extended range and large weapons payload suit this defensive mission profile. However, this defensive focus limits tactical flexibility. The J-36's large size and flying wing configuration make it less suitable for air-to-air -air combat against highly maneuverable opponents or operations where stealth characteristics prove insufficient. American operational doctrine expects the F-47 to operate offensively in heavily defended airspace where traditional aircraft cannot survive. The aircraft's smaller size and superior maneuverability enable penetration of enemy air defense systems and engagement of targets deep within hostile territory. The F-47's networking capabilities enable entirely new operational concepts. Multiple aircraft can coordinate attacks on widely separated targets simultaneously, overwhelming enemy defenses through complexity rather than brute force. The engineering comparison reveals two fundamentally different approaches to sixth-generation air superiority. The J-36 represents ambitious technological advancement through revolutionary aircraft design, 
while the F-47 emphasizes evolutionary improvement of proven concepts enhanced by advanced technologies. Chinese engineers focused on solving perceived limitations in current American stealth fighters through radical design changes. However, the J-36's flying wing configuration creates new challenges in propulsion integration, maintenance access, and operational flexibility that may prove difficult to overcome. American engineers prioritized capabilities that proved most valuable during 20 years of stealth fighter operations. The F-47's networking capabilities and system integration address real operational requirements identified through extensive combat experience. The outcome of this technological competition depends less on individual aircraft specifications than on industrial base capabilities, operational doctrine effectiveness, and pilot training quality. Both aircraft represent remarkable engineering achievements, but their success will ultimately be measured in operational effectiveness rather than technical specifications. Understanding these engineering philosophies reveals why the 2035 Stealth Fighter competition extends far beyond aircraft performance to encompass entire aerospace industries and military doctrines. The J-36 vs. F-47 comparison represents China's technological ambitions against America's operational experience, a contest that will shape air power for decades to come. What surprised you most about these competing sixth-generation approaches? The radical design differences, the manufacturing philosophies, or the completely different operational doctrines driving each program? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Subscribe to Flight Deck for more analysis of how emerging technologies will reshape military aviation. Until next time, remember that future air superiority depends on engineering decisions being made today in classified facilities around the world.